Hello, welcome to week two of the course. Last week we explored the fundamentals of citizen science. We discovered what makes a good citizen scientist and the types of observatories and projects that are happening around the world. We also heard from the We Observe partners directly, who told us about how they better understood the environmental issues they are tackling in their projects. We found out how they created communities and formed teams in their citizen observatories. We also formed our own teams and started discussing specific environmental issues with each other. This week, we'll cover data. We'll discover the importance of data in citizen science and look at some of the basic things to consider when you collect it. We'll hear from the We Observe partners as they describe the way that they went about collecting data. We'll also explore the tools and kits which are open and available to help you collect and manage your data. In groups, we'll discuss the ways that we can collect data. We'll look at some of the different types of sensors you can use and examine the other types of information you can collect. We will also look at some of the ways to create a data collection plan. By the end of this week, we hope you will be familiar with the tools and technology you have access to and that you'll know how to start your own data collection phase. I hope you enjoy the week and I'll see you again soon.